Now, if you've gone a while without a haircut, you are certainly not alone. But that could soon change now that barbershops and hair salons might reopen under phase two of New York's reopening process. That could be Friday, could be a week from now, two weeks from now. We just don't know. Despite that unknown, these types of businesses are making changes inside their shops so they can welcome back clients when that can happen. Josh Navarro reports for us. I'm excited to open. I'm excited to see all of our wonderful clients, but I'm also really nervous too. I'm not nervous about Corona. I'm just nervous about all the new changes in to play. Antoinette Tusky owns Salon Eleganza in North Gates. She's already coming up with ways to implement social distancing and other measures to stop the spread of COVID-19. We do have face shields for everybody, also the stylists. A sanitizing station and coming to the salon alone are part of the new changes. And some of the new salon rules is that customers are going to have to wait in their cars until they are called by the salon to go in. And once you come in, you have to get your temperature checked. So I got the infrared one where you can stand uh, two feet away from someone and it takes their complete body temperature. So if they have a temperature, we'll have to let them know that, you know, they're going to have to come back or reschedule. Well, appointments are one on one only. Um, no one in the waiting area. Monique Chapman owns the Groom Room Men's Spa in Rochester. She too will have her staff wear masks and face shields, plus sanitizing after every client. Chapman says they're bringing in a sanitation company to do a full sweep on a weekly basis. Because the ladies who work here have families to go home to and children, and also so do our clients. We want to make sure that everyone feels safe and secure while doing their self-care. Both salons we spoke to have full bookings and are adjusting schedules to get everyone in as they gear up to reopen. I'm Josh Navarro, News 8. Thank you, Josh. A reminder, these are the businesses that are included in phase two of reopening in addition to the barbershops and hair salons we're talking